All right, so the smartphone. This is the first camera we're going to talk about, and really, it's one of my favorite tools to use because it's so discreet. No one second guesses if you're a professional photographer. It's just it's a phone. You know, there's there's not a lot behind it, but it's revolutionized digital photography because it's so accessible. It's everyone has it. You have thousands of photos coming from a single event, and with social networking, you're able to connect all those photos. Instantaneously, which I think is really cool.、Um, I also love that you know the resolution, the optics have gotten so much better. So if you understand how to use the camera and a lot of the things that we'll be covering actually throughout this course, you can become a really amazing smartphone photographer. And it's just understanding the limitations of the phone itself. You know, some of the things are that you don't have as many manual functions, and Battery life. Ultimately, it is your phone. You know, you're using this for other things other than just taking photos. But it's ultimately one of my favorite cameras to use. When I was traveling throughout South America, I used it constantly.、Uh, this is actually a photo from Machu Picchu taken on my iPhone, and you know, I, I hiked for days on end. It is just so much easier to use my smartphone than pulling out my big DSLR each time. So that's a smartphone. It's, it's lightweight. It's discreet. And I think the technology is going to just keep getting better and better for these types of phones.、Um, but you know, the reason that you're in this photography course is to learn manual, to learn you know what is the other side of photography, and that's really getting into the next set of cameras.